Hi, I'm Stephanie. Today we will be exploring the Puppet Pals app on the iPad. It is an easy to use cartoon creator app that can create and record animated interactive storytelling cartoons. Here's how to get started. You can choose characters and backgrounds from the Puppet Pals catalog or you can create your own. When you first open the Puppet Pals app, you are given three options. Saved shows, more characters, and press to start. We are going to begin with press to start. To begin an animation, you are given the option to choose up to four actors, or you can add your own from your photo gallery by taking a photo. To add more Puppet Pal characters, go back to the home screen and tap more characters. On the left side, you will see a list of character groupings. Tap on the group of your choice and then tap install. Now, go back to the home screen and press to start. You will see your selected group added to the list of character options. To add a character from your camera roll, simply tap on add actor from photo, select choose existing image and tap the image you would like to add. At this point, a pinching motion allows you to resize the image and drawing around it with your finger allows you to crop the image. Once you've completed these steps, tap Accept. This will add your character to the in-app gallery. Here you will select your characters and move on to choosing a background. The second step is adding the background. Up to three backgrounds can be chosen from a selection of different themes. You can also add your own background from the gallery or camera. You will do this the same way you added actors from your camera roll, and you are now ready to create your first animation. The slider on the bottom allows you to choose your screen size. As soon as you press the record button, everything you do is recording including all background sound. You can manipulate the actors to move on the screen by dragging them across the screen and narrating as you do so. Remember, you're unable to stop and edit what you have done. You will definitely want to prepare and practice your recording ahead of time. If you happen to make a mistake or would like to re-record for any reason, just tap the record button again and your newest version will take the place of the previous version. When you are done with your recording, tap the save icon and give your project a title. This will automatically save it within the app. When you open your saved shows, tap export to send your video to the camera roll. Now you're ready to share your project. For larger presentations, you may want to record in separate clips and then use an app like iMovie to put them all together. So again, that is how you can use Puppet Pals on the iPad to help with interactive storytelling. It's time to get on that stage and bring your characters to life. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and check out our other resources on the Dear Dis YouTube channel. See you soon.